Please remember that all the opinions in the show are those of the host and should only be taken as food for thought. We're in no way telling you to do anything. Everything is kept anonymous for the safety of the listeners and no information is shared to anyone else. If you are easily offended by people's opinions or views, then thank you for making it this far, but this is not the podcast for you, so see you later. And please enjoy the rest of the show. All right, guys, have a brilliant time these holidays. I'm sure Jamie is vacationing out of the country once again. Yes, he did. (laughs) After listening to you boys, I watched the Friday films. It had me in a fit of laughter. Do you have any other recommendations of a similar type of films along the same tone? P.S. The beaver needs being <laughs> the beaver needs putting down. <laughs> that, that actually had me in tears when you said that. That fucking <laughs> that was so funny. <laughs> I can never remember the beginning of the chat line, but I always remember the end. It's something to do with a veterinary clinic or something. Yeah, I can't remember what it was. Yeah, you just oh, I don't know. I'd have to look back. <laughs> um, the Friday films are fucking brilliant. They're absolutely really funny. brilliant. I um, saw a, um, a clip on YouTube came up today of the dad when he's like, every time I come in the kitchen, you're in the kitchen. <laughs> like, <laughs> eating his grapes. Yeah. <laughs> the second one where he falls in the dog shit still oh. fucking cracks me up. <laughs> I love his brother in the second one, isn't it? Like the uncle in the, the, su- in the suburbs. When he he's absolutely like, cracks me up. When he's like, I was always the sort of guy that would never leave the hood. Never. I took as my I... check and I was gone. gone. <laughs> 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 yeah, I might have to watch them again. I don't know if Sabina. If, if I was Ice Cube, man, do you know the auntie that keeps trying it on with him? Yes, I would have been Mac, all over yeah. that, bruv. Yeah, all over that. That made me like in um, Straight Out of Compton that movie where his son plays him, mm. and at the end, well, near to the end, where he's right in Friday. Mm. And he like he writes a bit of it and he goes, I'm a funny motherfucker. <laughs> and I'm like, fucking hell. <laughs> I hope that was a dig at his dad. <laughs> 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 uh, fucking genius. Um, similar films with a similar tone. Obviously, Barbershop. Barbershop's up there. Barbershop's because definitely up there. they're another... That's his movies, isn't it? Yeah. Barbershop. Um, oh, oh, there's loads, man. I can't think off the top of my head. I I people hated it, but I love Norbert. Yeah, we we loved that when when yeah. we, me and you used to smoke a lot of weed. I don't was... understand why people hate that film. Was so fucking funny. So I loved as well the bit where like everyone's getting different parts of the turkey, and he's like, "Here, you can have this bit, turkey ass," and it actually is an ass of a turkey, like a big. <laughs> that cracked me up. Turkey. <laughs> Ty- uh, Tyrese, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Tucky ass. And then later on, it comes back up because he's gone out on a date and she charges in. And mm. he's like, Norbert hasn't been here. And he goes, well, who's is that? And it turns to the table and there's a turkey ass on it. I love his racist fucking dad, isn't it? Oh, the, the Chinese. The he chi- does a really good Chinese, man. Isn't the he? Chinese racist dad, yeah. He's absolutely hilarious. Yeah. Um... I'm trying to. Uh, yeah, how high? How high? Yeah, that's a brilliant that's a really one. Good one. You got grow house, grow house. Uh, weird one which came out quite recently. To be fair, um, Mac and Devon go to high school, which is Snoop Dogg and Wes Wes Khalifa go in the high school, and it's all, okay. it's a proper stoner film, I but it's fucking that. brilliant. I was one. like, um, don't drink your juice on the... What was it called? Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, that, uh, uh... Oh, I can't remember what it's called now. And you got enough... Um... Don't don't be a menace on the South Central while drinking your juice in the hood. Yeah, that's it. Fucking brilliant. That's really funny. Oh, you suck fir- your old dick, man. <laughs> <laughs> you got First Sunday, which is... Um... One of the films I was going to put forward for me and Dan to watch because I haven't watched it in years. Yeah, that'd be fine. I'd do that. Um, it's an, it's got Ice Cube in it, Cat Williams, Tracy Morgan, and Ricky Smiley. It's fucking hilarious. Mm. It's basically really like Friday. Good. They're good at Norbert as well, where they play the pimps. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's brilliant. 
Cat, I love Cat Williams. He's blowing the absolute internet up at the minute, slagging every other comedian off. But he is so funny. Oh, I saw him heckling some woman, and he was like making fun of her hair. And he was like, "This he's is like, mine." Oh, I'm not the. I'm the. You're the only one in this room with fucking ten bill, ten dollar fucking jewelry on, love. <laughs> What does he say to me? He's like, get off your fat ass and come over and run your hands through my hair or something. Yeah. <laughs> one of his funniest sketches ever is the one where his missus turns up and he's in the jail cell, isn't it? His missus turns up and she's got a, like a three-year-old white baby. And <laughs> he's been in jail for five years. And he was like, whose baby is that? And he, <laughs> she's like, it's your baby. He's like, that baby is Caucasian. <laughs> That is a white baby. <laughs> that's another thing. If at uh, the Dave Chappelle show, oh yeah, that's brilliant. Yeah, it's fucking brilliant. Like the 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 black white supremacist oh. is one of the funniest things I've ever seen. When he's like, um, it's quite niche though because I showed Charlotte that, and I thought she'd like it, but she didn't like it. It's really like some episodes I just didn't find funny, mm. and some episodes I just cracked me up like something crazy. So yeah, it's really the same with um. I watched a couple episodes of Key and Peele. Yeah, that's very similar. Yeah, and some Sometimes of the episodes, too far. but I think as well, I don't get some of the references because they're very like they're like from the hood or like from like you know a black person's perspective, where I don't get. Mm. So, but some of them, like one of the sketches of Key and Peele that I absolutely love is where one of them is texting the other person, and one is getting the messages as really aggressive, and the other person's not. <laughs> And he's like, um, what does he say to me? He says something like, uh, he's like, oh, you want to go right now? And he gets the message. He's like, do I want to go right now? Uh, yeah, I've got time. I can... Yeah, I'll go right now. Oh, oh, you want to go right now? I'll meet you here at seven o'clock. You be there. And he's like, all right, I'll see you then, then. <laughs> like he's geared himself right up. And the guy's there waiting for a drink. <laughs> Fucking genius. There's um, a there's one there's one thing that they do where they're trying to out hood each other <laughs> with the hats. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> it's like that's a nice hat, and like, the label's fucking hanging down over his face. Yeah, oh, and it man. comes in a plastic bag, and it's got yeah, like, yeah. <laughs> fuck it, yeah. Some of them are just absolute genius. Um, there was a really good one as well where they meet up and their their wives are with them, mm. and their the wives walk off, and he's like. You never know what she did to me the other day. She turned around to me and I was like, bitch. <laughs> and then like the woman's come in then. Like, oh, hey, baby. And then they get further and further away. And they keep going like I turned to her and I said, bitch. <laughs> did, did you say bitch though? Uh, yeah. Mm-hmm. I, uh, yeah, I said it. <laughs> it's so fucking ridiculous. <laughs> bitch. Um, but yeah. We gave you some movies there. Watch them. Let us know what you think. We'll definitely, now that we're doing the Ridiculous Movie Club every Wednesday, there'll yeah. be a lot more variety on things that we review. We're going to try and, and get out of like our usual genres. There'll be those movies and other things. So hopefully you enjoy it. I'm going to have to watch Friday now. The yeah. um, The one that when you showed me the second Friday... Is it still Friday, whatever it's called? Next Friday, I think. Next Friday. The bit where they're smoking weed in front of the Hoovers. <laughs> like, I've never, like, I laughed so hard I couldn't breathe because it caught me off guard. <laughs> um, That's when the the boss turns up not long after, isn't it? And, like, every time they try to say something, he's like, stop talking, stop talking. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he's like, you Jerry Hair, fuck out. Jerry Hair curled motherfucker. <laughs> Fucking brilliant. I really <laughs>